Vigo County school students are learning more about what they might want to do after high school. I want to become an RN for the ER. They're getting an experience they wouldn't be able to get inside a classroom. It's all to help young people figure out their futures. In tonight's education alert, News 10 Sarah Lehman caught up with the class. She joins us now in the studio with how this is helping them. A lot of these students are thinking about going into the medical field, but their teacher decided you can only learn so much through a textbook. Now this is where we want to go slow. So we want to stop, lift high. You heard that lot. For about five years, Scott Dalton has been helping students in Vigo County schools through an EMT program. It allows students to get their feet wet, determine whether they like medical uh, training and medical care, and then it allows them many different career pathways in order to pursue, pursue their goal. Like hands-on stuff, so it like really helps us to when we get out there and actually experience it, it like helps us out a lot. The school district recently bought a used ambulance, gurney, and other medical equipment for $6,500. It was paid for by grant money and donations. So let's get ahead of our career if we, like, we want to go into the medical field. I took a crack at loading and unloading the gurney from the back of the ambulance. Okay, so like this? You push it all the way forward until you can't do it anymore. Okay. It's a lot harder than it looks. And then what? But the students knew exactly what they were doing. Go See this little pole right here? Uh-huh. It's going to go into that hole and you're going to pull it forward. Thanks to Dalton. It's something that I can't replicate in the classroom. The most important thing for students is being able to help others. As long as we can help them and for them to get back out there and do what they want to do, that's all I really care about is helping them. Dalton said he has had past students tell him about moments where they've needed and used the life-saving techniques he taught them in class. And not only are they learning all of this incredible real-world information, but they're also getting seven hours of college credit. So it's a win-win for these students. Back to you.